What's good, y'all? Welcome back to another reaction on this channel, man. Now, this video right here is actually a video request. Someone sent this video to my DM and asked me to react to it. Now, apparently, this is a video of a transgender coming out and exposing Kevin Gates for participating in some sexual activities. I told you guys, a lot of these rappers, especially individuals like Kevin Gates, I'm not surprised. A lot of these rappers do some questionable things behind closed doors, okay? Now, hey, if that's what he's into, then that's what he's into. They sure do. Cut some blood 2.0, man. I already know what it is, man. Back with another video. You did what I'm saying? That's my record playing in the background. Y'all know what I do. Y'all know what I do with this shit. You did what I'm saying? Hey, shots out to the positivity game. Hustle's one. Hustle me with all that good stuff. Hope you too loud. Sometimes early, early. It did it always. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. But yeah, man. Shots out to the positivity game. Hustle's one. Hustle me with all that good stuff. Hustle's one. Yeah, I'm only shit, you know what I'm saying? Allegations, more allegations coming out. I a lot of allegations lately. Mm. Mm. It's been like a lot of allegations. People coming out with stuff, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, bro, the internet takes stuff and we're going to get to that point. Hey, appreciate all my new subscribers. Appreciate everybody that liking these videos, man. We'll keep going up, going up, going up on them, folks. Y'all already know what it is, man. But let's see what's going on with the boy Kevin Gates, man. I see a lot of out I see a lot of out here about it. Is it true? Is it not? We, 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 we don't know, bro. We don't know. I'm here to bring clarity. You know what I'm saying? And all that, man. Shouts out to that positivity game, man. Y'all been sending good love to me. I can feel it. You hear me? Thank y'all. Let's go, though. Let's see what's going on, gang. A little weird. I just find it funny it's that a people weird out put here. on a tough boy persona and a I'm a straight, I'm getting the guts persona, and yet they're, you know? But um, we're about to hop into today's video, okay? Make sure you guys do leave a like down below and subscribe. But let's hop right into it. The beans are just so. I went on a date with Kevin Gates. Okay. That, you okay. know, there's right, like two phones, one for the plug and one for the That's pussy. Yes, yeah, I was wondering. Yeah. And that was everything. Honestly, it was a really good experience. And like, he's just one of those people, like, people in the industry, like, they're so fucked up from like literally like the life that they have had that like okay so I DM'd him uh, you know I like go on my little sprees so okay, okay, okay. I'll like what I do is I'll go and like drink and I'll, I'll see who he's following and just DM every single hot bro you talking about she assumed that he fucked up already she thinks she's a damn psychic or some shit or damn god like how do you like a, 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 a psychologist he just automatically knows he fucked up from the back, his background. He knows where he is. That's a racist flag right there, bro. He even catch you. I got y'all. Don't catch everything. Hot guy, I see with the blue check mark. And hoping that just pays my bills one day. Cause shit, this and my bed house are not gonna pay itself. Um, and so I DM'd him. He was like, That's "Yo, cool, like, I think he was like in Atlanta." I was like, "I'm not like." So he came. He was like, "Let's go to dinner." And I was like, "Okay." Just like text me where. Like kept it really cool. Made a reservation at Mastro's, but like could have sent me a car service, but like I'm an independent woman, so like I'll call my own fucking superman. It's fine. Went to Mastro's and I was like, am I gonna get like shot or like get it like a fish? Like I was like scared because you know like the experience that I've had and the people in Bro, bro, not even reacting like I'm reacting. No way I need to come hustling but two point I do real reaction. You know what I mean? Hey, I I fuck with dudes though, bro. I go show some love to that dude pigs. He be up on it, man. Much love to both. And he love guy like me, so me and bro cool. You do what I'm saying? But he ain't, he ain't doing it like me. Oh yeah, it's different. You do what I'm saying? Like this motherfucker saying a whole. I'm sorry. I mean, I'm not supposed to be cursing like that. Excuse my <laughs> parts right now. You do what I'm saying? Like bro, somebody like this dude just sent you a car service and this this and that. Like this, hey, some of us have to pay pay this person a lot of money. You know, I want to see. You know, I'm just trying to be respectful to that community, to y'all and stuff, you know, Pe people are people, you know what I'm saying? Really, 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 what I really want to say, hey, God don't accept that, you know what I'm saying, period. So, I ain't going with the way what man say, God don't like God, I don't like it either. Trying to, trying to normalize something. Just imagine up a transgender person going in the bathroom with your child. I'm just saying, how would you feel then? Just saying right is right, wrong is wrong. But this person talking a lot, making a lot of allegations, 
Like for real. Hey, Luca Brassy, you gonna have to leave him saying hell up. What's up, Luca? Like, hey, I don't, I don't believe it. I said, no, for right now, how I, feel, I don't believe it. it ain't, it's just gospel. It's just talking at this point. People do anything for a check and a and a and a. Well, in LA are so beyond. Like, like, like that it's crazy because people like people Iowa in LA are so wicked, like, man. I think everything's so wholesome and like celebrities just like stay home. No, they're like out at restaurants every single fucking night, Monday through Sunday, not taking care of their kids and looking for a kid. <laughs> and like oh, all the somebody to like write off or like cut off or like don't ever react well, I don't know um, and so I was like oh god like, what am I getting myself into um, and he sat down he had like four phones he was saying like El Chapo was watching me and I was like okay <laughs> like, cool you know so I was like yeah, I was I'm like what is El Chapo <laughs> so much more attractive yeah, and that makes you so much more like honestly manly and hot that you like that you know that I have to work harder and pay more than all these other fucking dusty dusty bitches with like stinky <laughs> and so that was that and then he ended up like I find that crazy to me it's low key disrespect I, I find it low key disrespectful when men become women and they talk shit about women like I find that disrespectful I'm not gonna lie because God created women naturally beautiful you know what I mean? It's like, as a man, to become a woman and then try to shit on women or talk down on right. women is, is kind of crazy to me, bro. It's kind of crazy to me. Like, I think about it, the whole argument of feminism and whatnot, but yet, if a man becomes a girl and then talks shit about girls, it's okay. But if, listen, I don't get it, bro. I really don't get it. I, I, compl- I listen, I completely expect an individual like Kevin Gates to be a part of this type of shit, bro. Honestly speaking, but let's continue. You mean because he needed a tour bus connect, and I was like, I don't have that. And so I thought he was kidding. And I hung up on him. Yeah, I, I think I'll marry him one day because my last. <laughs> not after this. I'm not making it to my fucking wedding. <laughs> not the last place. No. <laughs> on the bottom of that. What are the other, like, have you been involved with any other? Bro, this shit, bro, this shit, this shit rain, bro. It's not like, when they hear, oh, that's a dude, or, oh, she's trans. They don't even think, and there's like a, like, because they already think all their, like, judgmental bullshit and are so insecure with themselves for being attracted to somebody who's transgender that it's like, they don't think what's in between her legs. I don't like that argument. I, 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 I really don't like that, that argument. And a lot of girls and trans use that argument. That doesn't make an individual insecure. I want you to know that. Just because I'm not attracted to men, that doesn't make me insecure of my masculinity at all. Just because I don't want my girl dressing a certain way, that doesn't make me insecure about my girl or our relationship. It's just a matter of, this is what I like, and I'm not, I don't like that. I'm not, you know, I don't like men, I don't like trans, I like vagina. I'm saying I I like the essence of a woman, I like the essence of a a female, a true woman. I don't want a man. You get what I'm saying? Like, I don't want that. That's, that's just me. That doesn't make me insecure as a man. That doesn't make me insecure in my own masculinity. Oof. But a lot of people use that word my insecure bad, very, very loosely and honestly in the wrong context. But listen, man. My boy Kevin Gates got aired out. I'm pretty sure she, you know, she probably messed around with a lot of, or he probably messed around with a lot no, of other. No, he didn't. A lot of niggas about to rap the industry, But I'm going to end this video right here. If you guys didn't enjoy, make sure to like, bro. Down below, subscribe, and I'm going to catch you I don't support one. this. I don't support this message. I don't support them. I don't support him no more. Because, bro, you put something up without real paperwork or real, like, evidence to say this man did that. Or then it was in the mix of no, 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 no phone conversation, no, no text message, no, no nothing, bro. That was all speculation. It was all made up. Like, motherfucker just made that shit up, nigga. You ran with it. You were goofy. My baby, I'm sending this text out, y'all. I'm about to end this. Got to end it the right way. That's some goofy stuff that dude just did. I used to rock with his channel. I don't rock with his channel no more. You just prove you a goofy. Hey, I gotta stop smoking weed. I can tell you, <laughs> this weed be having be like, bro. It ain't like when I used to be younger, bro. Like, I'm in my thirties, so it's like, 
when I was younger, so when I was like 19, maybe like 23, we bump back to back, back, back. Nah, bro. I hit that thing like three times. I don't lose it, bro. I'm like in a whole nother world. I ain't gonna lie. Right. Oh, my bad, y'all. I know this is a stupid old intro. I know. It's like the, the walk of shame in a way. I'm going to take it. Whatever. I had a little test message. Say to my little bro back. But he got first. You understand what I'm saying? You see why? Goofy stuff like this. So you become a goofy like this goofy right here. You dig what I'm saying? You will put out a video without no evidence. That's why I really did do this. I'm like, bro, bro just talking with the internet. So like you, he, he's a wolf and sheep holding because he be, he be speaking the Lord name and the Lord on my page and stuff like that. But it's ironically, he never put up nothing with the Lord. He always put up bullshit. Like on his page, he talks so heavy about, oh God, this and God and Jesus and Christ. And you know, they need, they're going to be there and this, this and that. But why you never put up nothing just in the Lord? Why you never put up nothing just for a day? You don't got no like no Bible uh studies and stuff like studies. Like, you know what I mean? Why you don't have nothing like just for a Sunday or just for a, a live broadcast? Praise in the name of Jesus Christ. Why you don't why you don't do that? He always talking about God, but this dude don't know who he be talking about, bro. How, hey, Hustle Bud 2.0, come y'all do a little quick video. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the in, 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 in the comments, my bad. I think it's a bunch of malarkey. I think it's bull larky. Stupid, lame, fake shit. Keep doing your thing, Luke Brass. Gotcha, bro. Real one, stay here. This dude's goofy, man. Hey, keep God first. Take care of yourself. Keep a positive mental attitude, you did. At all times. Let me take this call, too. This is my bro. This is my, yeah, my bro. Love y'all. 100.